Good morning, YouTube family members and friends from the Pop Century Skyliner Station. We are getting ready to head out for day three at Epcot, mm -hmm. day four of the entire trip. And uh, we got a couple more lands to knock out in um, the Epcot, World the World mm -hmm. Showcase. Yeah, we're gonna stop by America. Gotta go by there. A couple things we wanna see there and Italy and Morocco and a, mm -hmm. a few more lands we need to, to check off the list. But first it's a ride on the Skyliner to Epcot. So come on along. When you arrive on the Skyliner to Epcot, you come all the way at the International Gateway, which is backed by World Showcase. And the buses, you have to go out the main entrance all the way around at the front. Oh, that was a long walk last night. That was a long walk last night. And you night. know what? Kudos to the cast members. There were so many people that needed to exit the park and not enough buses and drivers and yeah, long and queue and long queues long lines a lot of time so and it was late and it was raining yep so and they were all pleasant and doing were, what they could doing the best yep, yep. yeah yeah all right we're making a right heading into world showcase yeah Going we're gonna over. try see if we can do japan france Morocco, America, and Italy today. Yep, that's we'll the plan. We'll see. <laughs> we do want to go to America. We want to see the yeah. Hall of, not the Hall of Presidents. What's that called? American Adventure? Or... Yeah. Uh-huh. And then the Voices of Liberty. Yeah. And barbecue. And barbecue. What about that they're taking a photo of. Go around on the back side and see. Taking pictures of the Eiffel Tower. And here's all the postcards and paintings for sale. Not really, but it looks cool. Found this lovely little table in the Morocco area over by La Isla Fresca. And sitting here in the shade and just watching the crowd start to come in. Very relaxing. We had a muffin and some hard boiled eggs in the room, but now it's time for some real breakfast. These are from La Isla Fresca. We've got a couple of arepas. One with just the cheese, the queso fresco, and the other one with um, cheese and chorizo. And we got a tropical breeze with rum and a coffee with chocolate. Bonus on the coffee, there's a cinnamon stick inside. Okay, Lori's gonna try the, we'll call it coffee with chocolate and cinnamon because we can't remember the like Dolce Actually, de Coco yeah, coffee. Yeah. And there's this little there's a cinnamon stick inside. Like a full. A full cinnamon yep. stick. Bonus. Inside. Yeah. The coffee. It smells and amazing. It's, and it's actually kinda the coffee's kinda thick. Uh-huh. Like it's put a lot of cocoa in it. Yes. Oh man. Mm. Okay. Every morning indulgence. This is so good. Yeah. Wow, that's really good coffee. And this is a tropical Tropi breeze. Tropical breeze with mm -hmm. rum. And, and you can get it non alcoholic or with rum. Yeah. Either way, yeah. you can have it. Can we just drink this all day long? Like uh, this is so refreshing. Probably just little sips yeah, all day long. Little sips all day long, but Florida, like wow, 
You need all these little refreshing icy slushy drinks. Yeah, this uh. Ah. Uh, mmm. It's got to stay cooled down. From the inside out. That's right. There wow. you go. I like it. Yeah. Oh, that is so good. Lori's going in for her arepa. Mm-hmm. Cheese. Egg. Egg and cheese? Egg and cheese. Mm. Mm-hmm. And now, I'm going to pick this up because there's a bunch of salsa on it. So, I don't want it dripping all over the place. This is a arepa with egg and chorizo and salsa. Bite everything. I like the arepa. It reminds me of a. I mean, it's obviously made out of corn. It's really good. It's like a really thick corn tortilla. Thumbs up for all of them. Would you agree, dear? Absolutely. This is pretty cool. A wall of spices, appropriate for the Spice Road Table restaurant. This is a spice garden, just right outside the Morocco Pavilion. Fun fact for the day, in many cultures, spices were once considered more valuable than gold. And they have these sculptures made out of different spices all attached to these balls. Garlic, that's favorite at the Maxfield House. We don't need a sign to know what that one is. That's rosemary. We grow that in a pot in our backyard. Actually, we've grown it in just about every place we've ever lived. Orange bell pepper. Spike the bee hiding over there. This is fennel. See the big bulbs down there. Experiment, another one of our favorites. Now we're heading from the Morocco Pavilion into Japan. Lovely view across World Showcase Lagoon from right between Morocco and Japan. Spaceship Earth and a flower and garden banner. Oh, it doesn't get much better than this. Bonsai Bougainvillea. I have never seen one of these before.
Hello Pikachu, welcome to Disney World. This is wild. Every Japanese pop character you can think of is here. There she is. Hello Kitty. I think this is the Japanese equivalent of an easy bake oven. Hello Kitty rice cooker. You could use this for a lunch box to take your cup of noodles to work for lunch. Cup of noodles luggage tag. Coin purse. Cup of noodles slippers. Okay. That's a these kabuki socks. I have to I gotta get that. Waving cat socks. I know these aren't for Halloween, but those would make for interesting Halloween masks. Oh. Get tea gear from all the nations. Uh-huh. And they don't have um, like tea cups. No, they don't have handles. handles. They're not. Yeah. Yeah. Isn't that pretty? Uh-huh. Oh, here's the one with the whisk. The whisk, the mm -hmm. tea into the water. Yeah. Okay, I would get those because then I wouldn't be embarrassed to have training chopsticks if they had a ninja Ninjas. on them. Beautiful. Okay, we're switching hat headgear mode. There's too uh -huh. much sun, so too now we're time. going to the. What time is it? It's like probably about 11:30, 12 o'clock. Yeah, it's like. Mm. Yep. Okay, morning's over. Yep. Hi, Mickey. Girls got to do what a girl's got to do. Oh my gosh, you got to stay comfortable. America's the next stop. Oh, next country? Next country oh. over. Yeah, got to have the shade. All the shade. All the shade. Uh-huh. Last night it was all the rain. That's right, it's a double duty kind of hat. It is, it, it serves both ways. And then today is all the shade. Uh-huh. <laughs> Moving on to the American Adventure from the Japan Pavilion. I like uh, when you switch, the very first thing you hit is funnel cakes. Well, yeah, it's America. In, in America. <laughs> Hello, Pluto. Beer flight here with orange coriander wheat ale, an American light ale, and a ghost in the machine double IPA. Look at that spread. Got a seafood boil, uh, got corn, shrimp, mussels, mussels potatoes, crawfish. There's some andouille sausage. Oh, and an andouille in, sausage in there. In there. Yeah. These are the boudin bites. Mm -hmm. And a praline, pecan praline. Pecan praline. Go! Pro tip, if you get the boudin bites mm -hmm. and you get the seafood boil, dunk your bites into the broth. And then you can just dump some of your leftover rice that's underneath the boudin bites, mm -hmm. put it in your broth and eat it like soup. Mm -hmm. The corn on the cob was really good. That was amazing.
How'd you like the American Adventure show? Really enjoyable. Yeah. Excellent. Yeah. I like the singers, the Voices of Liberty. Yeah. They were amazing. They were amazing. It was the first time we've ever seen that because it's the first time we've ever been here. But it was right. A, a good recap of American history. Very and, different uh, than the one in uh, Anaheim. Oh yeah, the Hall of Hall of Presidents or uh -huh. great moments with Mr. Lincoln. Yep. But, yep. A good uh, reminder of what built this great nation of ours. Good time. Okay, we're done here in the American Adventure area, so we're going on to Italy. On to Italy. We're gonna check off the last world pavilion. Yeah. Oh, let's go do Italy and maybe we'll come back here and have a snack. Okay, we can totally do that. When we first saw these barges when we got here, we knew they were for the show, but we like had no idea. What do these things do? Because they're crazy looking contraptions and we couldn't figure out how they would uh, be used for a show, but after watching the show last night and all the lights and how the arms come out and fireworks shoot out of the end and sprays of water and projection, um, just an amazing show. Good job, Disney. stuff from Walt Disney World too. We knew you could in Disneyland. Mm -hmm. Now we know you can mail it from here too. Oh, these always smell so wonderful. Nothing like the smell of a barbecue pit. Whenever there's real smoked barbecue around, we just have to stop off and get some. So we're at the Regal Eagle Smokehouse. We got some pulled pork, we got some pickles, we got some coleslaw, and we got some pork ribs, along with the apple cider and a Tennessee lemonade. Oh, it smells great outside too. This is the real thing. Tastes pretty authentic, doesn't it, dear? You can really taste the smoke on all of these. They're not messing around here. They are not. Smoke. The pickles are really good. They're not just like straight old dill pickles. They're uh -huh. cucumbery. I think they're dill cucumbers. Yeah, they're really big. They taste really good. Mm -hmm. You can really taste the smoke on the pulled pork, too. Excellent job. Uh, we're walking up to the Skyliner. We're heading back to the resort to cool off and chill out for part two. This is about the limit of our comfort zone. Two o'clock, we're out. Hello from the Skyliner. Yes, we're inside our very own Skyliner. Yes, oh, this cool breeze. Mm -hmm. Wonderful. Welcome it's about aboard 2 the Disney Skyliner at Welcome, International thank you. We're flying to Disney's Riviera Resort with a final stop at Disney's Caribbean Beach Resort. We, we hope are... you enjoyed your visit oh. to Epcot and World Showcase. We did we enjoy did our visit to, to Epcot. Did you hello in a different language today? No. no. Okay, I guess she's done talking. So Maybe. Yes. It's <laughs> 2 o'clock, so it's our closure time yes yes this is when we take a break get we out take of the a heat, break. go yeah. take a nap cool off cool off take another shower yes and cool off and just go to our hotel and just regroup yep put some of our um shopping away yeah. 
<laughs> Got a couple things. Uh huh. We're yeah. Slowly but surely knocking off the merch to get list. Right. Yes. And if you're ever watching us for ride um, reviews or anything, this is not that channel. Yeah, we don't get on a whole lot of rides. We don't get on a lot of rides. Soon we'll be flying past Disney's Boardwalk Inn and oh. Disney's Boardwalk Villas. Why, thank this you. This charming lakeside resort offers magical lounges, enchanting restaurants, and live entertainment on the boardwalk every evening. Charming. Charming, yes. And what a blessing to be able to stay there someday, maybe. Maybe. But not today. Not today. So, uh, this is the end of this video. Watch yep. for part two later. Yep. And uh, as always, we are so grateful. Thank God for all the blessings that he gives us, not just for our good, but ultimately for his glory.